Just four kilometers from Israel's capital, Tel Aviv, there's a Yofa town. It's located near the Mediterranean Sea, and there is a society with a significant Arab population. They're also in fear amid the conflict that's going on between Israel and Hamas. We get you in this exclusive report by Ashutosh Mishra, who spoke to that population as well. Tel Aviv is the business capital of Israel, but just few kilometers from Tel Aviv, near the coastal line, is the old city Yafo. Here it is called Zafa, the city which has a mixed population of both Jews and Muslims. The Muslims at large in language are called Arab, as mostly they are the Palestinian. Few migrated and uh, few are from Arab nations who are now the Israelis, have Israeli citizenship. And being in this much population, there have been harmony over the years living together. But ever since the terror strike from Hamas is carried out in southern Israel, all this area is under absolute silence. The harmony has lost. People see each other with suspicion. There is no harmony left. All the shops and most happening places of Yafa remain shut down for more than a week ever since the terror had broke out. This is the situation in the old city of Israel's Tel Aviv. There's always been peace and harmony in Jaffa, but of course we are afraid for what's, what's happening and what will happen. And, um, I think that's very much the sentiment in, um, in the whole of Israel, of course, among both populations, because everybody has its reason to be afraid. There are a good number of uh, uh, Palestine civilians who are now uh, living in Israel, and this part of Yafo, there's a huge number of Muslims who are, of course, called as Arabs, and there are Palestine, and they openly support, but the, the only sense of fear and concern, apprehension is that the moment they speak anything that will be played out of turn, and they call it that entire West is doing propaganda against them. There are several books like it, uh, which uh, supports Palestine, which supports their cause, and which supports very strongly with evidence as far as the entire dispute between Israel and Palestine is concerned. But they don't come out openly in Israel because they fear there will be more and more unrest in the residential areas where are they living at the moment. Do you uh, fear a sense of uh, fear after what has happened in the bordering areas? Uh, yes, I feel a bit uh, fear, but uh, for the whole uh, last week uh, there was no uh, no one place that was open, and it's all uh, all the places are like mixed from Jews and Muslims, and no one open any place. <laughs> and there happen at very, very, very terrific things. People who is not from Hamas also have to be sad because nobody like and want and what they do. They did really, really bad things. So it's not, uh, I think nobody wants that. Everything is empty, it's dead. Like there are no Arabs, no Jews, no one, no one is on the streets. Also, I feel that also the Arabs here are ashamed of what uh, the Hamas did there. Like, uh, even if there are Arabs here who are against what Israel are doing, it's like, you know, you don't do those stuff. So, I feel that like all the people are ashamed from the Arab side, or a lot of them and the Jews are just afraid to go out.
Muslims in Yafa, which is a Jews and a Arab colony in this part of Tel Aviv, openly support Palestine, but afraid of expressing their opinion publicly or even with the media. As they believe their concern and their fear is the moment they express or they come out on the road in support of Palestine, probably there will be crackdown against them by the Israelis authority. Subsequently, they believe their opinion can be played out of turn and that will lead to further clashes between Jews and the Arabs who have been living here over the decades in harmony. For now, there is concern, there is a tension, there is no business, the tourists have gone back, restaurant, hotels totally shut down, and now there is only and only apprehension, concerns, and tension alive in this part of Tel Aviv. Bringing you this ground report from Tel Aviv's Yafa town, this is Ashutosh Mishra for India Today.